Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Huddersfield Town career mode in FIFA 21. First off, I've just got to say, I do apologise by the lack of uploads in the last week or so. Uh, I will be uploading quite a lot in the next few days, just to kind of make up for it. Unfortunately, obviously, I still I do have a full-time job, so I do do this YouTube thing part-time. I want to keep doing the daily uploads, and I'll do that as best I can. You can bet yourself on that. I will be trying to get as much of this out as possible for you guys. Uh, obviously, just bear with me if uh, a couple of days you don't get an upload or whatever. Um, obviously, I know I had a couple of days off from the career mode. Uh, I felt a bit bad about that because obviously I only had two of the episodes out before I had a bit of like a massive gap between the next episodes. We are in October and we're against Bristol City for his first game. We are going okay in the championship not brilliant but we're going good we are seven so we're basically joint sixth uh but we do need to get a few wins and maybe if we do beat bristol here we will go into the playoffs we'll be all good and uh but it's going to be a grind all season to get a chance to go to the premier league first time of asking is going to be a grind but we're more up for it i will play this first game against bristol and then we'll probably simulate these next two games against uh, Rotherham and Sheffield Wednesday. And I, I'll, depending on where Reading are, we may play that one. We may, we will be probably playing the Bournemouth games. I think they they will be put pretty high up. Uh, we haven't got no cup matches. Obviously, we got knocked out previously. So let's go, guys! Right into the action. This is how I'll be doing a lot of the games, like, sort of, not always going to be introduced at all from the start menu, just going to be getting straight into the games, get right into the action. I have uh, changed the team around just slightly. Giving a few of the youngsters a go, giving a few of the players that don't usually get a chance. To be, wow! To be quite fair, I was thinking I was see, I was gonna simulate the Sheffield Wednesday game. They're actually second. They actually did pretty bad in the champ in the championship. Uh, the, pre the season just gone. So but I will show you the starting lineup for us, and then we'll look at. The Bristol City team we are going up against. I'm hoping Broby and Ida start getting that link up, but um, Ida is not playing today, I just remembered. <laughs> but look at this, Ryan Schofield, obviously he's been brilliant this season. Pippa still a right back, Ignacio, Edmunds Green comes in with the forward left back. Holmes on the right, Fernandez and Ayrton in midfield, Orlando Aaron on the left. Danny Ward comes in to the striker in place of Ida, who's a bit tired. Broby keeps his spot. You can play to X. Um, Huntsville Town right back. Jack Hunt is in there. Thomas Cowers. We've got Henry Lansbury. Uh, Vyman's a pretty good player. Uh, Semenyo. Pretty good player. Bentley as well. These are. This is a really, really dangerous team. We've got to keep our heads up. So let's hopefully have a good game here. Let's hopefully have a good episode. Let's start it. Oh, brilliant from Edmund Screezer now. Can Melander Aaron's get away? He can't. Wow, Jack Hunt was very, very quick to get onto him there. Melander Aaron didn't even get a chance to turn before Jack Hunt was on his arse. Oh, Edmunds Green was a little bit late there. Hopefully he didn't get a yellow card. Are we going to go short or are we going to go for goal here? Dower. Whoa, that was close. Holy shit. <laughs> it's Lansbury as well. Well, that could have been dangerous if it went any closer there. Schofield seemed very cool by them. Now to follow has been left. Broby. Puts it into. Oh. 
fingers Fernandez. An item from distance. Oh, and Pippi tries to put it into the mix. Can't find Broby. Inacio get finds Dwayne Holmes. And Broby, what a turn! What a goal! By our big money signing! Finally a bit of cost by the young lad! Good work by Danny Ward to hold up the ball. Who we have will put in some constant pressure on Bristol City. This was a great little turn. Great, great pace as well to get away from the man. And then what a finish. I'm really surprised that was not blocked. But what a goal. By Brian Broby is coming up good. Alright, it's only his second in like 12 appearances. It needs to improve, but that is a good way to start. Could actually be the first goal I've actually scored with him. Trying to put that constant pressure on him. Ooh, Schofield had to make a really good save there. He's done that a lot this season. Schofield just making absolutely silly saves. Oh, oh, oh my God. That was... How close was that? Oh, Dowder. That was close. It was always rising, but hell. Buddy, Al, you have to have some uh, cojones to go from there. Oh, Adam is green. That's not good enough. Oop, Carl Aiton was late there. And that is too simple. That was just two really, really late challenges. And that is not good enough. Just look at this. He's just had all the time in the world. I really don't know why Fernandez isn't closing down there. And then Patterson is just played in so easily. Jamie Patterson just... Oh, that's just so easy for them. I'm very disappointed now. Oh, he's definitely got to get yelled. He's a red! Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me? Did I even show you? That's a fucking joke. I knew it was a yellow. It definitely wasn't a fucking red. You're an absolute joke, ref. Going for Marins. Now, Broby. Oh, Red Holmes! Oh, and Throw is just saved. Nearly an absolute easy goal for Holmes. Aaron, oh, he tries to come inside. Carl Aiton's going to get that though. Dwayne Holmes. Broby! Aaron! Aaron! Rolando Aaron! With a brilliant goal from the left winger! Played a bit of ping ball there. Broby's shot comes off the player and went very, very kindly to Rolando Aaron. And we have taken the lead back with 10 men. Come on, lads. I'll take that. Go on, you fist bump that air, Rolando Aaron. Pippa deals with it. The hell? Oh, brilliant from Harry to follow. Oh, and Schofield with a crucial save. Gonna bring in Fernandez off, bring Bakuna on a little bit more pace in that midfield. Fernandez has done well. good job today. Oh, I don't know what the hell was happening there. Pippa going ahead here. And Pippa, ah, oh, so you can tell the difference in quality. Just nothing there. Brilliant from Saar. Just keep it down that end. Oh, brilliant from Harry to follow. Again, he's had a good game today. Roby is on an attack here. Dwayne Holmes now.
and that's not going to matter. It's 2 1, baby. We win. And that, I hope, should take us in to the playoffs. They gave us that one hell of a game, Bristol City. Gave us a few scares. But we come out on top. We'll land our with a crucial, crucial goal. A very gutsy performance, I have to say. And indeed, guys, we have gone up to sixth place ahead of Derby and Millwall. We are level with Bristol City now. We are have got a game against Rotherham, but we have got a very important game coming up against Sheffield Wednesday, who are apparently un unbeaten up to this point. So um, I'm going to use my second team. Even my second team's pretty similar to my first team, so I'm hoping it shouldn't really matter that much. It just means I get to play with the best players I like. And oh, my fucking God. And we lose. This is honestly what's going to be the grind in this career mode. Especially in the first few seasons. Not having a not that good a team. In simulations, it's a bloody flip of the coin. We just played 23rd place. And look, just like that, I mean, thankfully... Well, not thankfully. Basically, if Derby or Millwall get a point, they'll go above us. So it doesn't really matter. Let's get this game underway. It's very, very bright, <laughs> I've got to say. But I've got to say, it's the one thing I love about the Huddersfield aesthetic is um, is the whole stadium. I love the atmosphere of this stadium. I've actually been to the stadium quite a lot of times, and I love it. It's, it's just such a good feeling being there, and I love this career for doing it. So I'm hoping we can bring more glory to the stadium. Out and down. Adam Reach is there with him. Oh, and Dwayne Holmes is met. He's got his back, and Adam Idea is gonna make Adam Reach pay for his mistakes. Dwayne Holmes keeping the pressure on, getting the ball back. That's what you get for when you pressurise him. Look at that. He managed to get it back. He powered into the box. Pilly in an absolute platter for Adam Ida, who's turning out to be a really good get. Adam Ida take a bow, take a bow, Dwayne Holmes with the pressure. And Adam Reese would not want to see that one back. Oh, that is brilliant, whoever that was. The Coon is going to pick this one up. Adam Ida. Broby, he's got a lot of space here. We finally get in the spaces, and Adam Broby absolutely power drives that one. Gets the ball, Karoma, Karoma, I oh, curls, but goes, gets a block on it. Bakuna gets in front of uh, Patterson there. And you see Adam Ida, and O'Brien, O'Brien's there. What a save by Westwood. He decides to get back in position, really. Oh, brilliant, brilliant. Oh, Saar, what a clearance. Bakuna with 1-2 with Karoma. And O'Brien. O'Brien still driving. Still got the ball. No, he hasn't now. And fuck me. I hate when them side tackles are like fucking, it just, it's like time stops for it. Oh, brilliant again. Karoma, it's three on that left, and Karoma can drive, and he's got Westwood a one on one, and Karoma gets the second, and we have two goals to the good. We are right spicing this up. Why can we not do this in sim games, boys? Because this is brilliant. We are attacking with so much finesse, so much dignity. We are absolutely storming the gates. If they've not lost the game yet, Jesus Christ, we are opening the barrier. This will be the floodgates. Adam Reach. Ooh. Sneaky. 
you that. That was full at the back. And that is what good teams can do to you when you give them the space. Cornick at a back post with the follow was always a bit of a mismatch. Reach, to be honest, opened that barrier with a little bit of a cheeky back heel past Pippa and we had to bring someone out. Sheffield Wednesday. Reach. It's Harris who's just been creating loads of problems for us right now. Spurs header can't go anywhere where I want it to. But we do get hit out. Gotta bring eight in on, just give him it was a bit more defensive outlook. And that oh my god! If he quite uh, two headers and they managed to pull it back. Who was marking him? I think it was Ida who just let him go. June Borner. Oh my god, now! Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! Are you fucking kidding me now? Fuck right off, ref! You can fuck right off with that shit! Bears is fucking on me! Isaac and Benzo is just fresh coming on. Now it's convinced it has that pace. Fernandez! Oh, Bruby! Can he put the goalkeeper off? Yes, he does! Karuma keeps it alive! But then he's once right at him from eating! We can't get a ball back. We're not going to get another chance. That was it. No one knocks. Fucking hell. The ref does not have any leniency with the time. Oh, I'm so disappointed. I don't really have any problems with their goals. Because we just got outdone and outclassed in them goals. But we could have created a little bit more, I think. But it is what it is. Let's move on. So we have got another game here against Red and Beyond 19th. Again, it's going to be one I simulate. Probably going to play three games in this episode. I'm hoping we can get something here. We do! We get a win! Adam Ida, come on! Finally, a sim game gives me something. I've had a very mixed bag in this episode, but you know what? I'll take it. I can actually say for once, I'm not actually too bothered about the game. The game's not really done that much to piss me off, really. Let's go guys, final game of the episode. We are against first as well. So this is not going to be an easy game, but you know what? We're going to give it our best shot. Yeah, we, we nearly beat the second team in second. So you know what? It's hell of possible, so let's try and do it. Oh, brilliant. Okay, I didn't get enough on that. Oh my god, he still nearly scored after so many times getting in front of it. Oh my god, fuck me. Brilliant from O'Brien. Oh, brilliant one too. And Adam Ida is in, but Begovic makes a brilliant save. First bit of class we've shown today. Broby! Oh, what a header! Come on, lads! I'll take that! Two goals in this episode for him. He's getting better. I'm learning how to use this lad. And this just shows me he's good in the air as well. What a head of a hit! Look at that, going to the ground, but he managed to get past Begovic into that bomb corner. 
That is a great, great header. World class header that from Brian Broby. Get in there. His third goal of the championship. Come on. Cook. Shane Long. Oh, O'Brien goes in hard on him. Jefferson Lerma. Oh my god! Why can none of my fucking side tackles meet? Cause some points someone on the line. Oh my god! Inasha still blocked it! Brian trying to get in on Lerma. But Lerma's doing a good job, but Pippa is there. Oh, Sars there. Fucking hell! Talk about fucking walking it in! Fuck me! What am I supposed to do about that? Look at this! How many times did pass it through there? I'm getting sick of fucking sliding and just my players just don't make contact with anything! Broby, Broby, finish it, Broby! Gets his second of the game, I was just quiet through that. I just weren't realising realize what was happening. We were just probing there and we finally got it in. Brilliant finish, get in there Brian Broby. Oh brilliant work, brilliant defending. Kuna out to Dwayne Holmes. Now to Ida. Brian Broby. He's going to find Ida. He's going to keep it alive. Oh! We pulled a good save out of Begovic. We pulled something out of that one. Oh, Adam Ida. Oh, he can't quite get in there. Or he might have just nipped in there to get that, but he didn't. Oh my fucking god. You, this game's an actual joke. Are you... F it's happened... Look how many times. He fucking... Oh my god, Bakuna. He just passed it straight to a Bournemouth player. Get off. Get off, Bakuna. Fuck. This is why I'm so unsure about Bakuna. Because he's just... I don't know whether I can trust him because he does shit like that. Bob. Broby! Oh, Broby was there! No! Karoma just put some more on that! This game's a joke. It doesn't fucking do anything you want. It's fucking... Oh, it's just such a stupid... Do you know what? It's fucking... What I said before about this game not done anything today to fuck me off. It has today. When it does stupid shit like that. It honestly tells the fucking game to fucking do something to fuck you up. Like that. Do the pass there from Karuma to Ida. So fucking simple. He'd have been in to curl one in. It would maybe not an instant goal, but it'd have been the chance.
But no, his fucking pass was so fucking weak, it was intercepted with ease. This is fucking unacceptable. Fuck off, FIFA. Fuck with this shit. But guys, we have just had... We just got the most luckiest of... Uh, we just found possibly a future goalkeeper for this field. A future England legend. If we didn't done right. I've just found this guy who has just come through a scout report. Nicholas Dixon. Good name. He's six foot five. He's got 73 to 94 potential. So very good base potential. He's 67 overall already. So he's, he's on par with Schofield. Not like he's um, just going to up and replace him. Because I think Schofield has been pretty good. Plus I want to see how fast Schofield can grow. But Dixon and him can honestly battle it out. Um, I'm not going to promote him just yet. I want to, I do want to try and get that some of his stuff up and see how he does get him get him try and get him overall his overall up especially his defensive work rate try and get his good uh, reflexes going and then maybe in like an FA Cup game later on in the F in the series we will bring him up either try and learn him out or even use him myself because as I said um, well Scuffle has actually gone up to 68 now that I said that I really am liking how much his team is growing and like, it's so nice to see. I love seeing a team grow. And they're all growing somewhat together as well. We're all get, nearly, we've got a nearly 70 rated base team. Like, it was only really Ida who needs to get up to that. Um, Karoma's on the verge. Zar's on the verge. Schofield's only a couple behind. Even our bench is pretty good. Um, so I'm pretty happy with that. But anyway, guys, that is going to end this episode. I hope you've enjoyed until next time guys thank you so much for watching don't forget uh i'll be trying to get these episodes out as soon as possible make sure you let me know down below anything to do with the future career mode uh, in fifa 22 as i told you at the start but until but first we're doing this career mode and i want to make this as iconic as the sulfur one was if that's possible so make sure you keep putting down plays down below what you like what you liked about the episodes all that good stuff until next time, guys, I'm the Hawkeye Punisher, and I am out.